You're alive. I'm alive. But, but I, but I, we, we saw your skeleton. You were dead. Are you a ghost? <laughs> there had better be an amazing explanation for this. Speak, apparition. <sighs> okay. Okay, okay, okay. You both deserve the truth. It all started back at the observatory. Roxanne was kidnapped. I was gonna stop you. My head wasn't in the game that day. We were kind of going through the motions. So, using my super speed, I decided to go clear my head. Then I realized we had done this same silly charade our entire lives. I tried to get my mind off how I was feeling, but I just felt stuck. I began to realize, despite all my powers, each and every citizen of Metro had something I didn't. A choice. Ever since I can remember, I've always had to be what the city wanted me to be. But what about what I wanted to do? Then it suddenly hit me. I do have a choice. I can be whatever I want to be. No one said this hero thing had to be a lifetime gig. You can't just quit either. That's when I got the brilliant idea to fake my death. Copper drains my powers. Your weakness is copper? <laughs> Once your death ray hit, I've never felt so alive. So I borrowed a prop from a nearby nursing school. Metro Man was finally dead. And Music Man was born. Music Man? That way I could keep my logo. Cause of what? I was finally free to get in touch with my true power. Weaving lyrical magic. Check this out. I have eyes that can see right through lead. You're I horrible. Granted, you have talent, but there's a madman out there destroying our, your city. Ugh. How could you do this? Oh. The people of the city relied on you and you deserted them. <laughs> you left us in the hands of him. No offense. No, I'm with you. Look, we need your help. I'm sorry. I really am. Um, I'm, I'm done. You know, little buddy, there's a yin for every yang. If there's bad, good will rise up against it. It's taken me a long time to find my calling. Now it's about time you find yours. <laughs>